good morning students welcome to today's class today we are uh, going to revise uh, chapter 1 introduction to chemistry and today we will be doing uh, some we will uh, discuss some important question and answer okay so let's start so from this you can get a uh, idea what type of questions will be there in exam so uh, and this uh, this type of questions i have given in the worksheet also and all these answers you will be getting in the uh, study material which was provided before okay so let's uh, discuss this let's start example give example for each of the following so this kind of questions uh, are there uh, so first one is food preservative so uh, food preservatives uh, these are sodium benzoyl acetic acid only this two will be okay okay so uh, you have to uh, memorize only this two sodium benzoyl and acetic acid or vinegar acetic acid or vinegar vinegar is the common name for acetic acid and uh, acetic acid is the uh, chemical name of vinegar we will say okay next building materials brick cement paint steel these are building materials okay so uh, brick cement paints steel these are building material cosmetics many cosmetics are there you know uh, so any other uh, example also you can give out of uh, other than this three which i have given but that should be a correct one so talcum powder lipstick uh, lotion or uh, face uh, cream and all moisturizer that also can be given as uh, example for cosmetics next nail polish is there also uh, next natural fiber natural fiber example will be cotton silk jute wool okay fertilizer uh, urea potash fertilizer are those substances which will increase the growth of the plant okay so urea potash uh, sodium nitrate ammonium phosphate these are some common fertilizer used next synthetic fiber nylon terylene these are synthetic fiber okay these are man made fiber so uh, next uh, name the following okay so this kind of questions also may come so in one word we have to uh, give the particular word we have to give for the, for that substance okay so name the following chemicals which help in increasing food production that is fertilizer so you have to identify the substance which we are asking for or uh, the substance or the name of the uh, substance uh, whatever okay so chemicals which help in increasing food production which chemical uh, help us to increase the food production that is fertilizer so in one word we can, we will be saying the chemical as fertilizer so this word is required next type of medicines used to relieve pain so uh, there are different kind of medicines are there and uh, they are uh, uh, they work in different manner also okay so uh, some we uh, used to relieve pain some we used to uh, kill the germs and all uh, or uh, some we uh, used to treat uh, infections and all so they have different names so for the medicines which we use to relieve pain these are called analgesic okay so analgesic medicine like paracetamol next uh, chemicals which help to kill pests these are pesticides chemicals which help to kill pests next type of medicines used to treat infections 
caused by bacteria the infections which uh, which is uh, which are caused by bacteria that to uh, treat those infections we uh, we generally use the medicine which is called antibiotic so antibiotics there are different kind of antibiotics but the main term uh, for the medicine is in one word we can describe the medicine as antibiotic next chemicals that enhance the appearance of external parts of human body chemicals that enhance the appearance of external parts of human body this is these are cosmetics cosmetic helps us to enhance the appearance of external parts of human body next chemicals used to preserve food and control the wastage of food chemicals used to preserve food and control the wastage of food these are called preservative preservatives are used to preserve food and control the wastage of food okay next chemicals which help to kill insects that affects the growth of crops these are insecticides so there are uh, there is a very uh, uh it's a very uh, easy to remember because insecticides uh, or pesticides or fungicides these are just uh by the name only we can find out for which reason these are used okay so for to kill insects this will be insecticide to kill the fungi or to uh, prevent uh, being affected by fungi to prevent that we need to use fungicide the chemicals which help to prevent crops being affected by fungi that will be fungicide okay so these are similar similar uh, type of chemicals and easy to remember next name the scientist who discovered the following several times i have given the uh, in both the worksheets uh, this question was there okay so atomic theory this is related to john dalton he uh, discovered this he worked on this oxygen was discovered by antonio lavoisier if you cannot remember the full name then uh, this i told also uh, earlier i told that if you cannot remember the full name suppose antonio is a little bit tough to remember Uh, if you think so then lavoisier means the surname is also that also can be given because generally uh, we use the surname only okay so oxygen antonio lavoisier uh, periodic table that was uh, introduced by dimitri ivanovich mendeleev so mendeleev is the most popular name okay so uh, with this by uh, mendeleev's surname only he is uh, much more famous so only mendeleev can be written okay next match the following uh bricks and this side in column b there are uh building materials so bricks are the building materials so side by side uh, we will be writing d okay the correct uh, option next paracetamol uh, analgesic substances uh, which used to reduce fever uh, which used to reduce pain analgesic okay this we have we did no see medicines used to relieve pain so these are called analgesic next so paracetamol is a kind of analgesic next talcum powder this is cosmetic on uh, one of the cosmetics next nylon this is nylon is a synthetic fiber okay nylon or terilin also can be given so both are next see uh, 
uh, uh, different kind of medicines are there, their example and features. So antibiotics are those uh, medicines which prevent infection caused by the microorganisms. Uh, example of uh, such kind of uh, medicines are penicillin, streptomycin, these are antibiotics. Next, uh, antipyretics, uh, example for this kind of medicines are aspirin, paracetamol. So antipyretics means they reduce fever, these medicines reduce fever, analgesic, pain reliever, this uh, we did. So pain reliever is analgesic. Example is uh, aspirin, paracetamol. Analgesic uh, uh, aspirin and paracetamol. These two medicines can be used both as uh, antipyretics, drug, and analgesic. Okay. Uh, next, antiseptics. Uh, these uh, medicines, chemicals, prevent infection in wounds. Okay, that's why antiseptic. This is the uh, this is the name uh, we can say, or by this we can uh, represent these chemicals as antibiotics. So, example will be neem, tincture of iodine. These are antiseptic uh, antiseptics. Yes. Next, antacids, anti acids means the chemicals which prevent acid okay so example for this kind of uh, medicines are antacids milk of magnesia they relieve stomachache due to acidity okay so uh, this is all for today This is all for today uh, and uh, you just uh, as we are revising this so you just uh, go through this uh, study material and uh, whichever study material we have given uh, you just go through that uh, go through the worksheets all the question answers I hope uh, you are not uh, facing much problem you are not facing problem at all uh, because I am trying to uh, make it as easy as possible okay so things are little bit uh, as these are new to you so maybe it uh, seems to be little bit tough but uh, you just uh, follow the classes and go through the study material as well as the worksheets okay and uh, as uh, we are doing the revision and we are discussing the important question answers also so this will be enough and i hope uh, you guys uh, will not face any problem here. Okay, so you just uh, keep on studying as you are doing. Keep on uh, doing the regular classes. Okay, and uh, take care of yourself uh, and study properly. Okay, so uh, this is all for today. Have a nice day. Thank you.